Frank, can I get your coffee? Oh, good, thanks. Uh, right. I'll uh, go and settle up. Don't forget we've got that meeting. Yeah, I'll see you up there. Is something wrong? Look, I'm just going to come out and say this. I found a pack of pregnancy tests in your bag and I couldn't help noticing one of them was missing. Uh, it's false alarm. Well, I'm very relieved to hear that. Uh, I was late. And you know I've had a vasectomy. Yeah, just making sure, that's all. So how could you be pregnant, Megan? Because sometimes vasectomies go wrong. I mean, they're not foolproof. Come on. No, I'm being serious. And I only have your word that you've had the snip. Do you honestly think I'd lie about something like that? I don't know, Frank. All I know is that I was two weeks late, I was in the chemist, and I saw the kit, so I picked it up. What? You know what? What, you think I've slept with somebody else? Can you blame me? What happened to trusting me? I do, it's oh, just... I need to go. I'm sorry. Yeah, I... In future, don't go snooping through my bag. One over there, where the marquee's going to be, and another one over there, where I thought we could have a dance floor. Oh, and the DJ has requested a podium, so we're going to have to get the carpenters in. Either that or we tell him no. Why would we want to do that? Well, we'll build it. He'll decide it's not right, so why bother doing it? Actually, it's a woman. Hmm. So, how did it go with Frank? Fine. <laughs> Megan speaking. You're joking? Seriously? Well, surely you can find somebody else. Yes, well, it's a bit short notice for me too, actually. No, just forget it. Problem? Yeah, the guy that I booked to put the lights on the roof, he's gone down with food poisoning. I can do it if you want. It's all right. I can manage. Fine. Hope you've got more appropriate attire. Everybody 